Hey guys, uh, how's it going? Uh, it's been about a week since I made my last video, and uh, I'm kind of sick right now, so uh, that's why I haven't really been up to it. But I wanted to answer a couple threads before they got too far away from me. Uh, first one is uh, glowing cabbage glowing double lock cabbages uh, t-shirt design thread now <clears throat> if I took some you know if I had the spare time to draw and stuff because I don't want to just put up a doodle and if I knew anything about computer graphics I would have done that but uh, I'm more of a letter guy uh, or a photograph guy when it comes to t-shirts uh, designing them anyway but uh, I had a couple ideas uh, and when I, when I worked at the tattoo shop, uh, that's what I was. I was an idea, man. That's why I never became a tattoo artist. Uh, but uh, my first idea was a picture of a large collection. Uh, it could be one of ours. Uh, like Mr. Hall of Fame's, Dan's, Derek's, Jeff's, uh, yours, Golden Cabbage Jeff's. And then uh, just the words under it just says, My Playlist. And that's just kind of like a stab at the whole MP3 culture. Uh, I did put in parentheses, uh, pardon my French, but uh, I, I put in parentheses, fuck MP3s. But, you know, we, if we want everybody to wear the shirts, not everybody wants to wear a shirt with language on it, right? Uh, the other one was a quote I heard a long time ago. And I don't know from who, maybe one of you guys can help me out. It could have been a musician or music journalist or something but uh and it again it's not appealing to everybody uh but the quote was you can't roll a joint on an mp3 i thought that was pretty funny but uh don't necessarily have to use that either and then my last idea was probably the one i like the most it's just the letters ytvc youtube vinyl community um uh, and the reason I wanted to do that was to kind of like, I mean, I know this is our medium that we use to share things, but I don't, I don't really necessarily want to attach ourselves with YouTube because it's a, a corporate entity now. Um, and I think that this community is more of organic grassroots. So, uh, YTVC. Uh, maybe some cool like 70s style lettering or something like that and then like a picture of a 45 adapter like like that you know maybe just like the silhouette of one um, and yeah uh, and then I've had another quote that I just read in here have you guys read this book yet I, I went I got it a couple days ago and I've gone through it I'm almost done I got like maybe 10 pages left uh, what a fantastic read, Vinyl Junkies by Brett Milano. Uh, there's a quote at the beginning of the book where he's talking about serotonin levels uh, as far as collecting goes and with uh, an experiment that was done with uh, monkeys uh, with regards to, uh, I think they were testing them for abuse of alcohol and drugs, but... Uh, the, there's Basically the book was saying that the fact that we collect has to do with the lower serotonin level and we're trying to compensate for that. But um, uh, the, the, the line that I, I don't know, that I just, just made me chuckle, uh, and there's a lot of them in this book, but uh, it says, okay, uh, well, I'll, I'll read the prelude first. It says, a study by the National Institute of Alcohol Abuse and alcoholism found that rhesus monkeys with lower serotonin levels were also more likely to demonstrate violent or dangerous behavior. This is with regards to alcoholic monkeys. And then it's, uh, the quote I, I liked was, uh, no word on whether the monkeys preferred to collect vinyl or CDs. <laughs> so I thought, I thought we could, we could put the CDs, because a lot of us do have CDs, but uh, I, I thought maybe just truncating that to no word whether the monkeys preferred to collect vinyl 
you know, just some kind of weird oddball quote uh, with the YTVC thing. Uh, and I think maybe eventually we'll come up with, you know, a better name once we, uh, you know, w once this organization, as it's kind of become, or cult, as it were, uh, starts growing, uh, which it has tremendously. Uh, so, maybe we'll come up with another name, even though we use YouTube as our, you know, sharing area. Uh, but yeah, uh, we could be form our own little club uh, of record collectors, right? So, yeah, those are my ideas, Jeff. Uh, had another idea of like, uh, if I, if I had time to draw, like maybe just the fifty style, like uh, you know, like comic book, like or fifty style, like advertisement, like you know, where everybody was like, you know, so happy to be using their blender or whatever. Same thing, like except with regards to like a turntable or holding a record, you know, that kind of thing, too, but, uh, yeah, but again, I'm not the most fabulous of artists, so, uh, couldn't really illustrate it, but those are my ideas, and I hope you like them, and, uh, I'm making another thread response, you can hear I'm a little stuffed up, but I've got some new stuff, uh, in the past week that I'm going to be showing, uh, probably tomorrow on my day off, on a seven-day work binge, so, uh, thank you. The Lord that is over tomorrow. So, uh, see you guys soon and have a great day.